hello uh, good evening welcome back to learnautomation.com in this video tutorial we'll see how to handle uh, windows authentication in selenium web driver using auto it so uh, before going to the actual video tutorial let's discuss the high level agenda for today so we will divide this tutorial into following section first we will see what is authentication window and uh, how it differs to the uh, from browser to browser then we will see how to write auto it script to handle this authentication window and once our script is ready we will see how to integrate this auto it script with selenium web driver so many of you are not familiar with authentication window so let me show you what exactly it is so let me open a web browser i have a url which exactly will show you uh, what exactly this authentication window is so let's start with one uh, secure url so you can see before accessing this particular url it is asking me the credentials username and password right so until i don't have valid username and password i cannot um, navigate to this particular application and even i don't have the valid credential for this particular application but uh, my main intention just to show you how we can access this authentication window and you will see the different behavior because right now it is showing in this form and if you open the same url in uh, you can say in chrome you will get a different authentication window and if you try the same application in ie browser you will get the different authentication window the authentication window is same but the form it is uh, coming it's totally different you will get a different ui in ie you will get in this form right so we will be using the uh, one auto it script to handle this authentication window and using selenium you cannot handle it okay we need some other tool because you cannot uh, identify this window using firebug and firepath you will not find any uh, id name so you cannot handle it using selenium so we will be writing a small piece of code in auto it and later on we will integrate this with selenium web driver okay so what i will do i will simply open auto it editor if you have not installed auto it then i will highly recommend please go through my previous video in which i have shown uh, how to install auto it and once you install auto it you will get uh, auto it installed in your machine by default it will go to your program files and you will get one folder called auto it3 so here you can simply go to SCITE uh, folder and here you will get the actual editor in which we will write the code so this is the editor here we will write the code okay now what exactly we are uh, trying to do once this authentication uh, window comes by default you can see the control is here so I will not do any operation I will simply type some username let's say username I will not do any mou uh, mouse event I will simply using this tab key so the control will come to the password field again I will enter some uh, password and I will click enter okay. so you can see it has uh, taken uh, username password and since I don't have valid username password it is asking again so this is how we are going to do manually right so same we will do using auto it so for this we will be using one simple send command okay so if you want to see how it works simply type send you will get this uh, send method that is already available and it will ask you what exactly you want to type so let me say uh, valid username then I need one keyboard event right so again I will use the send okay and you can see it is asking um, send me uh, give me the key which you want to perform and if you see the description as well send simulated keystroke to the active window so I need to specify a key which I need to uh, perform so I need to perform tab right for tab you can directly say tab okay so we have specify this tab again I will say send and once I press tab definitely it will go to the uh, you can say next uh, field that is password 
here I will enter some password let me enter some password called valid password and again I will use send because after that I need to enter uh, press enter button right so I will simply say enter make sure all in caps so this is my small auto IT script that is simply entering some valid username then it will um, enter then it will perform tab operation so control will come to the next field like this then I will enter some password and I will press enter so it will click on ok so just to make sure whether we have written the right script or not so yes looks over yeah some syntax issue this double quote should come outside and in the curly braces you need to write the keyword so let me make a small change here this double code we need to add after this yeah looks fine now same we will do for this tab so we'll keep this outside yeah okay so now uh, it looks everything fine valid username tab password now let's save this auto it script so i will click on save as in the desktop i have uh, I don't have any folder so I will create one folder called auto IT script script and here I will say handle authentication window that's fine handle authentication click on save so this script will be saved in the desktop and uh, yeah this is our uh, auto IT script so I will simply compile this since I am using 64, so I will say compile script 64. If you are working with 32, go with this compile script x86. Sorry, uh, I selected the wrong option. Let me select 64 and it's giving some issue. Okay, it looks like some issue with our scripting. This is the uh, one already written script. It looks some issue. Okay, so for this valid password, we did wrong. We it's not a valid uh, keystroke, right? So it is not allowing us. So let's save this. For keyboard events, only you need to write in curly braces. If you are if you want to write simple thing on. Uh, that window you can directly use this double quotes now I will save this so again go back to this auto IT script now let's compile this yeah now it's fine because now it's compiling you can see we did some small mistakes so it was not allow us to compile now this exe file is generated now we can write the script so I will create a separate uh, package for this auto IT uh, demo now I will create a new class called uh, handle window I will take public static void main if you are using test ng you can directly take test ng and now I will write a small four lines of code just to open the URL and open that application so I will say web driver driver equal to new Firefox driver then I will maximize it driver dot manage dot windows dot maximize then I will simply open that uh, URL so I will open this URL okay and make sure before opening this URL you just call that auto IT script because once you open this application it will ask you that uh, user ID password right so before executing just call that exe file which you have created so I will say runtime dot get runtime dot execute and here I need to specify the exe path which we created so our exe path is yeah this one so I will mention the full exe path so simply use two or backward slash yeah it's fine now you can see it is giving me some 
exception called io exception so i will use throws now this script is fine i will not perform any operation because my main intention just to handle this uh, authentication window so you will notice on behavior once i run this it will simply uh, enter username password since i don't have any valid, valid credentials so it will again ask but you will notice it will enter username password so i need your little attention here so let's analyze the output so run as java application so some people write this uh, 16 line number 16 code after this opening url but generally i use before calling this uh, url uh, just call this exe file that we created so just now notice so now it is not working so let's try this after opening the url okay uh, yes let's try after this So let's run it one more time. Sometimes that uh, the previous method which I shown sometimes that works. In case if that is not working, then go in this way. So let's see how it works. So it will open. It will open that URL. it's not entering there's some issue let me check so uh, we have seen it's giving some issue and I rectified I just checked one thing so we notice one thing before opening the URL it is entering uh, username password in the uh, URL itself right so it's not waiting it's simply after maximizing it's running that auto IT script so what we need to do uh, this is what we have written so we will add one more thing here like it will wait until that window is not appear so we will add one uh, you can say one more method win wait active so it will wait until that authentication window doesn't come and once it is appearing then it will perform the uh, respective actions so method which we are going to use is win wait active window wait active until that window is not active just wait so if you notice the window title comes authentication required so this is the text so i will simply specify like wait until this uh, authentication window is not coming it will wait and once it is coming then it will do the remaining four actions that we have specified now since we change this uh, some scripting part so we need to delete the previous exe file i will simply save this and this is the auto it script that we have written I will simply say compile script x64 so again I will get the new exe right now just try the same thing in this case what it will do it will open Firefox maximize and it will execute that exe now it will wait until that authentication window doesn't come so then it will open the URL and if that uh, window coming then it will complete the remaining exe part so let's run it and let's see the execution so in this approach you will find one issue because right now we are giving authentication required so it will work fine with Firefox and if you open this here it will work fine because here also it is simply uh, giving authentication required but in IE you will get Windows security so for IE you need to write a separate piece of code uh, you can give the title called Windows security okay so let's see it's uh, opening url and you have noticed it entered username password and click on enter since we don't have user id password it is again giving this but our script executed successfully okay so in the same way you can enter the valid username password and it will work fine i took this url from one of the blog i just got this url from this blog this is my friend blog called sudhir it's a very useful block and 
you will find some more interesting topic here so once you have time just go through this blog as well from here I got this actual URL uh, so I was searching for this URL where I can get this authentication pop-up so I got this URL from here you can try the same in your company application okay uh, if if you have any doubt just let me know let me check whether we have got all the things or not we have discussed what is our uh, authentication window and we have seen in our browsers uh, we have written the script as well and integration of auto it script with selenium so if you have any doubt uh, regarding this topic you can drop uh, me an email my email is mukesh one at the rate learn hyphen automation.com you can visit my blog that is learn hyphen automation.com and uh, you can connect with me on facebook google twitter linkedin so hope you like this video if you like this video please share with your friends and if you have any doubt comment below and please don't forget to subscribe my channel okay, and please share with your uh, friends as well uh, i think yes we can close thank you for watching this